you doing today? Welcome to the Bilser Show, eh? Fucking right, boys. Today on the Bilser Show, I'm going to show you how to install a horn on your golf cart. Because I didn't record yesterday. Why the hell would I? Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification bell bar button if you like that kind of stuff. Why wouldn't you? Mama's cooking us some hamburgers, boys, on the old barbecue, eh? Fresh bought dog food burgers. Friggin' right, dog food burgers rock and roll. Anyways, it's windier than Nick's out, so hopefully my, uh, Simonic. Sir, I'm Attic. That thing. Hopefully that microphone there, boys, knocks off some of the wind. Why wouldn't it? I'll get this thing out, and I'll let you have a gander at her. Let you have a little gandage. Where can I put you, boys? Will you sit over here for a minute, will you? Let's see. How's that feel? Does that feel all right? Right in the sun? Why wouldn't you? Let's get this thing out and take a gander. Now that I'm done driving like a maniac and smoking up the yard with two-stroke oil, eh? Hammering the thing with two-stroke I am. I'll show you where I put the button, boys. So, the button for the horn of my golf cart. Oh, I have a cushion coming too. Stay tuned for that. That will be coming up soon. The place where I put my button is right here, boys. I use the starter button. Hey, freaking right I did. I'm not gonna show you the horn yet, but that's where the button is. So when I come up on somebody, I can uh -uh, stealth mode them, eh? They don't even know it's there. See, they can't tell I'm really hitting it, can you? Can't tell I'm really hitting it, boys. Girls, peoples. I know you can't. Why would you? So, how I did this is... <clears throat> the only problem with this horn right now, I'll tell you, I'll tell you the problem with the horn first, boys. It didn't come with everything it said it come with. It was supposed to come with a relay and a button. But, no, nothing in the box, just the horn. Why wouldn't they? Oh, pardon me. Holy. I wanted to use my own button anyways. On this installation, we didn't use a relay because I'm using a starter button. And it's good for about 40 amps. So, in all honesty, I don't really need a friggin' relay. Not just to hit the button a couple times. But how I did it was, I ran a power wire from the battery all the way along here, boys. Up here. In behind this tape so it blends in because I can't pull this off now and I'm not gonna. And into the starter button. Out of the starter button, down here, like this, and over to the horn, boys. And then I had the ground come off and I ground it right to the cart. But there's a horn. They're on eBay. They're pretty cheap, they are, so I'll put the link below for that in case you guys want one. But listen to this thing, boys. Oh, hey. And if you're wondering why I put it under the friggin' hood, because it's too loud. So at least if it's under the hood, it dampens her down a little bit. But that's how I installed the friggin' horn on the old golf cart. And it works friggin' decent. Doesn't it work decent? Does it work decent? It work decent. See? Even Mama thinks it works decent. But now see, when the hood's down, it's not as loud just perfect now it doesn't give you a headache we don't need a loud horn on the friggin golf cart just a half decent one what do you think of that huh decent why wouldn't it be what are you doing watching you show off the horn you like it how does it make you feel does it make you feel horny uh -oh. oh what are you making dinner horn and hamburgers horn and hamburgers boys friggin right she is oh time she did something oh time he did something I don't believe her. Do you believe her? Leave your comments below if you do, but I don't think you do. Because I don't. What you're saying is you want me to tell dad to call you first before, or no, you're gonna call him first. Yeah, just just take Mel over to your dad, let your dad know you're bringing her there, and I'll call your dad and tell him. You're gonna call me? No, no, no. I'll call you, I'll just text your dad and say, bring Melly over tomorrow when I'm done my appointment, I'll call you. So you want me to tell him you're gonna text him now, not call him? Yeah, I'll probably text him, I guess. Yeah. Okay, so you're going to call instead of text. Right. Okay, I get you. Sounds good. Okay. Ciao. All right, love. All right. Talk to you later. Yeah, bye-bye. Fuck, dude, you're not going to believe this. Did you forget him? I forgot it. Yeah. That actually might work out good because I fucked up too. I need like a three inches or like two and a half cut off of each one at the back. Okay. I got the wrong measurement. So you need two that 17 by 17. Yeah. 17. I'm glad you come over then because I misunderstood. I thought you only need <laughs> yeah. one. Well, that's what I thought too. Are you telling me I wasn't recording? Hi there, no one is available to take this call. Please leave me a message. Thank you. Have a good day. Oh! Grandpa's not home so he can't freaking get a joke of the day. 
Frick sakes. Oh well. You'll have to call me back, I guess, eh? Freaking right, he will. But anyways, I gotta see what I got on this video because I don't think I was recording when I was talking to my mom, and that really sucks if it's, that's the case because I just cocked myself over, boys. Frig! Why wouldn't I? So anyways, what have you guys been up to? Guys, girls, peoples? Leave a comment below and let me know what you've been up to this week. All I've been up to is I installed a horn on the old golf cart, and I've been working, boys. That's about it. Friggin' right it is. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like and hit that notification bell bar button. And uh, you know what to do for now. Mm -hmm.